William won Rift with Harry will continue to play him as Megan State pissed off. Prince William has been warned that there are no signs that his rift with the Sussexes has abated as one commentator claimed that Meghan Markle remains really pissed off about her exit from the monarchy. So as we get right into it, please do ensure to subscribe, turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. Prince William has been warned to expect the rift with Prince Harry and Meghan to flare up in public in a resurfaced documentary clip. The ominous warning for the heir to the throne was noted in the third and final episode of the bombshell Channel 4 documentary series The Real Windsors, which examines the future of the royal family and aired last year. Broadcaster and commentator Bonnie Greer said that Meghan was still really pissed off about her exit from the family as the reef threatens to blow up in the future. The documentary narrator suggested that the reef could continue to plague William as he tries to prepare his family for a bigger role in the monarchy. Miss Greer remarks, they have a woman who was married into the family whose ancestors had descended from enslaved Africans, okay? They hit the jackpot. Now she ain't in the family no more and she is really pissed off about it. The narrator noted, survey suggested that many of the generations that royals most need to appeal to are the ones who are most sympathetic to Meghan's side of the story. Katie Nicole, a royal correspondent at Vanity Fair, responded, Gen Z doesn't connect with the monarchy. It's absolutely crucial that the next generation of the monarchy connect to the Gen Z. If they don't, the monarchy becomes irrelevant. The documentary narrator predicted more drama for the Cambridges, adding, The family drama's no sign of abating, not least in the form of Harry's impending memoir. Earlier in the program, broadcaster and journalist Camilla Tomine explained the frosty relationship between the two couples on display to thousands at the Platinum Jubilee. She said, there were reports going into the weekend that things were better, but, you know, we could see very clearly there were no interactions between the couples or the children. Why Harry and Meghan were over for that weekend? Things aren't rosy between the two brothers and your wives. William and Kate feel that Meghan and Harry haven't acknowledged the, the hurt caused by the opera interview. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, bye for now.